at the tight end position, Cameron Brait is on the radar, or at least should be for most people in season-long fantasy leagues and even for DFS. Greg, obviously there's an injury there with the Buccaneers. So what else do you have in terms of Cameron Brait and why you might be using him? It's amazing as we look at all the tight ends to pick up this week. They're going to sound a lot like the quarterbacks because they all play for the same teams and have the same matchups. So we start with Cameron Brait, who long, Maria, has been the favorite target of Jameis Winston. O.J. Howard out for at least this week with that knee injury. And Brait got that contract extension. We talked about him last week, and I told you to stash him on the bye week. You can't stash him anymore. You can pick him up and play him. Tight end is the shallowest position in all of fantasy football. That's why we're always looking for the tight end that can grab you a touchdown. Last week, we told you to pick up Austin Hooper. It worked out this past Sunday. Now, make sure you grab Cameron Bray because it's going to work out for you in week six. We talked about the matchup with the Falcons not being scary for Jameis Winston. The same is true for Cameron Braid, and they also have a documented connection with tight ends being hard to come by. You got to love Cameron Braid, at least coming up this week.